So we're here at Download with Dan Mongray of uh, Canada's best kept secret, Martyr, or as us Anglophones like to call them, Martyr. Um, and the last update that we had was via the website that you'd started recording, or not recording, started writing the new album. And I'm just wondering how that process is going. Well, things are slow n right now because I'm touring with Voivod, but I have my guitar in the hotel rooms and try to, you know, write stuff actually. And I don't have a recorder, so I write it down. And uh, yeah, I've got ideas. I'm pretty much inspired right now, so it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be fun. Okay. Well, how how far along are you in the process? Do you have uh, whole songs written, or uh, we have a uh, one song like done, and uh, the guys are working on other stuff right now. And uh, yeah, we we want to be uh, more as a team now because I used to to write a lot of stuff musically, not really not for the lyrics, but for the music. And uh, now it's more uh, like a band, you know. It's more everybody's is involved in the writing process, and it's the music is richer because of that. Because it, it, you know everybody got their own influence, and we put it to get together, and it'll sound like uh, more as a teamwork. All right. Are you finding it to be a more arduous process now that it's a team effort, or has it always been somewhat of an arduous process? Arduous, like, arduous, like, like hard to, yeah. yeah. It's difficult because the music is pretty complex. Uh, it's uh, it's very progressive uh, our stuff, so uh, it takes time and uh, and uh, sometimes we 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 write a whole song and we have to re redo it, re redo the whole song, rethink it. And uh, there's some complex part for each instrument, and we don't want it to, to, uh, to sound like a chaos, you know, like it's an organized chaos. It, it, ha it, have, it has to be organized, and it's very difficult to, to put all the, the, the puzzle into place. But uh, once it's done, it, it works well, and it sounds uh, very progressive and complicated, but it's a reflex of, of life, reflection of life itself. So I guess life is it's complicated these days. You've said in the past that Voivod was probably the most influential band for you and what's it like being a part of Voivod now? Like how, how surreal is that? You saw the movie uh, Rockstar? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, but uh, it's the same kind of thing. I mean, uh, when I was 12 years old, I went to my first metal show in Quebec, Montreal, uh, not Montreal, but Canada, and it was Voivod. And I, I loved Voivod before that, and I, I learned the songs, and I, I, I'm really a fan of Voivod work and, and uh, Piggy's guitar playing. Always, always been. So when they called me to play with them, like I, I thought, I couldn't believe it. And and that's sad in a way because Piggy's not there anymore. But it's an honor for me to play his part and to, you know, uh, help. Uh, um, um, you know, uh, spreading his music around and for as long as I can, I'll do it for sure. It's an honor. Absolutely. And I mean, what, what do you think Voivod's legacy is for the Quebec scene? Because they were kind of the band that jump started what is now like, you know, a massive world renowned scene. Well, what do you think their legacy for that is? I think Voivod, it, uh, Voivod is a very unique band I mean for this the sound and the, the way they, they wrote music and that is I think uh, influenced most of the band in Quebec every band is very unique uh, in general all the band all the bands you, you can't compare like Cryptopsy with Gorguts with with the Spies Icon with Voivod or Martyr or Neuraxis they're all very different and there's always a progressive side of, of the music and each of those bands, very dissonant chords and, and stru weird structured songs, and it all comes from Voivod. So uh, they were very in, in, influen influential, yeah. and um, yeah, it started from Voivod, and they were the first band in metal, I think, I'm pretty sure. Uh, uh, they, um, they got a, a record deal at a really young age in the early 80s, and they went to Europe, Germany, records uh, some some uh, music, and then touring the States in 85 or 86, something like that. So it opened the doors for other bands. They're they're really pioneers of, of the metal yeah. in uh, in Canada. Well, onwards and upwards again here with Damon Gray of Martyr. Can we have a little high five? Finish this off. Thank you so much for your time.